Good afternoon, Faith family. How is everybody today? I can tell you here in southern Oklahoma, it's not a bad day. It's actually really kind of nice. We have the sun shining brightly above us, and we've got warm enough weather that I'm okay in a sweatshirt and jeans, so I'm not complaining. I'm very thankful that uh, winter is cut short. Uh, well, maybe not cut short, but it's not as bitter and cold. Maybe it's that way everywhere. Uh, maybe you're having extreme temperature differences and, and stuff going on where you live um, also. But I think that that's kind of the characteristics of the Southwest. And so for me, I will deal with winter if in total it only lasts 25 days. <laughs> um, they've been sporadically spread out through the past couple of months. Um, but honestly, you can't really do much better than, uh, I think it's like 55 degree day. Uh, where the sun is shining and you can feel that warmth. It's very nice and it's only going to get better as the week goes by and uh, this is my backyard I'm watching Roly before I gotta go in um, and today you know in my investment my team members we were all talking about goals and I've got three goals three top goals that I'm hoping to achieve here very shortly and having both income with fiat and also income through my investment i know my three goals will be met much quicker than um than the date that i set so <clears throat> my three goals my top three goals are to have my truck in tip-top condition um functioning correctly in all ways um, and my other goal is to have three to six months worth of rent and bills set aside and that's totally totally achievable uh, and my last goal is to be able to retire and um, I look out at my backyard here and I see the peace that it brings me and you know I want to continue to receive this peace <laughs> it's so warm and sunny and there's um, my puppy there's a fenced in yard that he can run around in and I don't have too much stress you know and I like that, and I'm ready to stand firm to keep my peace in all ways, um, and, and struggle through busy season and everything like that in order to accomplish all of my goals, so that way, by my birthday, I can officially say goodbye to slave labor and, um, maybe even purchase this house behind me by October and you know everything will be good um, so what are your goals what are you trying to do so that way you can find some peace in your life I wouldn't have come to this conclusion if it weren't for many days of prayer and really praying <laughs> Like, I really got to know what my next move is because I don't, I don't have a move yet. Um, but to keep doing the same thing repetitively and that's the definition of insane and <laughs> to do the same things repetitively with expectations of different outcomes. Um, not insane and I don't want any of you to be <laughs> insane. So let's, let's. Let's start working on some goals. Just three simple, totally achievable goals. And, 
you know, every day, one day at a time. Give thanks to the Father above for giving us eyes to see and ears to hear and knowledge to use both of those so that way our next steps aren't in vain. Um, I love you. I hope all of your skies are as clear as mine. And I hope that the sun is out where you are providing you with some warmth. Um, I love you all. And I hope that you stay blessed.